life is a chase to become the ultimate version of you. That person do exist, but in the very near future. In order for you to become the best version of you, you need to have three things. Number one, you need to have a desire. You need to have a desire to make change. You see, one of the things that many, many people constantly asking me is that, can you teach me how do I get more desire? Well, let me tell you the answer. There are no books in this world. There are no mentors in this world can teach you desire. People don't make excuse to the things they feel good, good about. We all only make excuse of the things that we don't want to do. So usually when people look at their final product of successful people, they tend to think that they're different, they're talented, they got intimidated. But the, in reality, what they don't know, they don't see is the scars inside them. When you're able to help others, that's not your immediate family to achieve their goals. And at the end of the day, when they're success, and you have a little part to do with that, you know, it doesn't have to be a lot, just maybe just a little bit, just, just a fraction of 1%, that, that's the ultimate satisfaction, man. First, of course, uh, you know, success doesn't come overnight. You have to put in a lot of work. I'm talking about massive amount of work uh, in order for you to achieve success. And we realize our generation, we also share the vision of purpose versus paycheck. Right, we want more about purpose than we want paycheck. If you ever deal with a millennial or anyone that's in the younger generation that has 20, quote unquote, 20 or 30 years to work, we don't look at the work. We want to look at the purpose. You have to have a team member copy you. You have to lead them by example. And I've learned also not to judge myself, which is huge. Because as a leader, I'm very hard on myself. I take a lot of responsibility. I love like a mother and I protect like a father. That's like me, right? Like. Okay, I give everybody the benefit of the doubt. No matter how hard you work for somebody, no matter how much good you give to somebody, they'll always end up remembering the little bad that you do. Are you willing to change? You know, if you see this opportunity, are you willing to get change? So speed of improvement, if you can focus on that, eventually you actually will be better.